Hey everyone, Brent, uh, I'm back. Uh, so um, my landlord came to get the rent. I gave him $900 and I appreciate all your donations. I really appreciate that. That was, that's awesome. <laughs> that's just, that makes me so happy. That's, that's great. Thank you so much everyone, really, really. I, I, I appreciate that. Um, that's the good news. Um, I'll have to give him the rest next Friday unless any other donations come in before next Friday. Um, the bad news is, is he also dropped off a little present, um, a 30 day notice. Yeah, uh, we've been on a month to month since I think last October. And, uh, I knew this day was coming. I just didn't know when, um, he's been wanting to, he wants to fix up the house and sell it or rent it to somebody else, probably sell it because he's in his mid eighties. And uh, I don't blame him for wanting to get out of the rental business. So, um, yeah, so when it rains, it pours. You know, I, I'm trying to get out from what just happened um, in last month. Uh, January wasn't so good either. So January, February, March. So we're three months in a row now where, you know, just things have happened that are de derailing me. I'm trying to get back on the tracks, trying to get on the tracks and get this train moving. And my dog is interrupting me thinking I got food. Puppy dog. Anyway, here, come here. Say hi, everybody. Say hi. This is Copper. Hey, Copper. Anyway, um, yeah, so I'm trying to get on the, 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 the train, get the train back on the tracks and slowly get the train moving in a, you know, in a positive direction. And someone pulls the lever and, you know, yeep, the train's going this way and it's like heading toward a cliff and it's going to, you know, go off the cliff. So, yeah, um, three day notice. So we've got until... Well, he gave it to me today, April, um, or March 4th. So we got till April 4th. So it's uh, me and my son. So the dilemma is, what do I do? Because I don't have money set aside for deposits. I know moving nowadays, you gotta have a lot of money first month, last month, um, cleaning, pet. Yeah, pet, yeah, you, well, maybe I'm the pet, I don't know. But yeah, um, so I have to find something to do. We have to figure something out between now and uh, April 4th. So if you've been in the situation where you think I'm a 30 day and you don't didn't have the funds to move, let me know in the comments, how did you move? How did you get into a place without having, you know, three, four thousand dollars in the bank um, set aside, which I, I should have. You're supposed to have six months of income, right? They say you're supposed to have six months of income set aside. Um, I don't know anybody that's got six months of income set aside for something like this. So you could say, hey, it's my own fault for not planning for something like this. Okay, I'll, I'll take it. Um, but I at least have to find a place for my son to live. If nothing else, I gotta have to find a place for him to go. Um, but I'm hoping to find a place for both of us. But let me know if you've been in a situation and what you, what you did to find a place. Um, it looks like I'm gonna have to, I'm gonna have to change the title and up the contribution amount on the GoFundMe. I'm gonna have to change it to need money for moving expenses and raise it up to a hundred thousand so I can buy a condo for me and my son. I'm kidding. I'm kidding. Not that anyone's going to, you know, throw a hundred thousand dollars at a, somebody who, right? Anyway, that's nonsense. Anyway, it's a nice idea to have money to buy a condo for me and my son, but you know, realistically, yeah, um, not going to happen. So anyway, um, I'm not stressing out too much yet. I mean, I have to get the ball rolling. Um, I got, I got to get rid of stuff. We got to sell stuff. I got to try and find a, a, a place. I don't know what I'm going to do. Um, I'm just so drained from what's been happening in the last two months that I'm, I don't have any energy to, to panic right now. I don't have any energy to panic. I just don't. And, but I know I just can't sit here and twiddle my thumbs and say, Oh, well, you know, it's March 2nd now, um, or April 2nd, uh, you know, I guess I better go get a bottle and rub the genie and get the genie out to make three wishes. That's not going to work. You know, that's, you know, so I can't sit around with idle hands and expect something to just drop into my lap, right? <clears throat> so if you know what I can do, if you have any suggestions, let me know in the comments. And uh, yeah, things just get better or worse or uh, worse for the better. I don't know what it is, but anyway, just want to give an update on that. But that aside, um, thanks everybody for helping me um, pay most of the rent. That's, 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 that helps a lot. That helped <laughs> alleviate a lot of the stress. I just have a, another obstacle to w overcome and um, I'm sure we'll, we'll get through it, but uh, I need some advice. I need some, 
help to kind of guide me and to see what we're going to be able to do to move out 30 days from now. So anyway, that's going to do it. Um, yeah, have a nice rest of your day. I got to go to sleep for work. And uh, yeah, anyway, <sighs> bye. I'll see you later.